So today we're talking about different math vocabulary words. Um, more specifically, we're going to look at adding fractions and all of the terms and vocab words that go along. The first thing we'll look at in a fraction is the numerator. That is the number that goes on top of the fraction. Okay, and then the next one is denominator. That's the number that goes on bottom of a fraction. So every fraction has a number on top and bottom, your numerator and denominator. The first one term we'll look at on this one is a proper fraction. That's where the number on top is smaller than the number on bottom. The next one we have is an improper fraction, and that is where the number on top is larger than the number on bottom. An improper fraction actually means if you simplify, you'll get a mixed number, which actually happens here. Next one, a mixed number has a whole number and a proper fraction together. Okay, and then the last one is simplify. When you are simplifying, a fraction, you are getting it in its smallest form. 2 over 6 simplifies down to 1 third. They both have a single common that you take out of each fraction. Next, we have the term common denominator. For your common denominator, you'll need your least common multiple, or LCM, which is where you list your numbers out, and it is the smallest number that they go to. So the first fraction we're going to add is 1 half plus 5 over 6. So to add these, we have to find a common denominator with 2 and 6. So we list out our multiples, and our answer is going to be the least common multiples of those, which in this case is 6. So we take our 1 half, and we have to make the bottom 6, so we're going to multiply the top and bottom by 3. When we do that, we get 3 over 6. The 5 over 6 stays because it was already 5 over 6. Now that they both have a 6 on bottom, you can add your numerators, 3 and 5. 3 plus 5 is 8. We get 8 over 6. That is an improper fraction. So we have to divide 8 divided by 6 to uh, simplify. And we get 1 and 2 over 6, a mixed number, but it's not simplified yet. We have to simplify it to get 1 and 1 half. Excuse me, 1 and 1 third. When we get 1 and 1 third, our 1 half plus 5 over 6 equals 1 and 1 third. Our next, our next fraction, 1 third plus 3 fourths. We've got to get 3 and 4 to the same thing, so we find our least common multiple of 12. So we multiply by 4 on the first fraction, 3 on the second. When we do that, we get 4 over 12 plus 9 over 12. Add your numerators, 9 plus 4 is 13 over 12. Once we divide and simplify that, we get an answer of 1 and 1 over 12. Created using Powtoon.